Yeah, they come from the 1200 metre marker. Untidy beginning for one or two of them. Irish Bell, though, came out flashing her speed. Does she have success on the outside? Is very eager. So Irish Bell by three parts of a length. Duchess of Sussex looking to settle into a rhythm in second. Flaming Lass on the inside. Purple Merchants in the Yellow Silks in fourth. Umzunduzi's fifth. Star Choices in sixth position. Nakia seventh. And My Saving Grace is the trailer. Full steam ahead for Irish Bell as she flashes her speed past the 600 by two. Flaming Lass is hunting her towards the inside. Duchess of Sussex on the right. Umzunduzi towards the inside. Then comes Purple Merchant. Coming inside the 400. Irish Bell being kept together. Duchess of Sussex running awkwardly towards the inside. Ums and Doozies now in the clear and starts to run onto the outside and flaming lass. Irish Bell looking to fend them off at the 200 metre marker. Nakia's running on. Ums and Doozy. Irish Bell the last hundred. Nakia gets going late on. Irish Bell clinging on for the win and just maybe lost it in a photo with Nakia. Purple Merchant and Ums and Doozy. Irish Bell. Well, Another nail-biting finish here at Hollywood Bets Gravel today. We've just seen the running of race seven. It went all the way to the wire. Irish Bell led this race for 1,199 and a half meters. But in that last half a meter, she was nabbed by number five, Nakia, trained by Michael Roberts and superbly handled by Rachel Veniger. But first up, we congratulate the groom, Um Tabila Nguani. Congratulations, a thousand rand compliments of Hollywood and Gold Circle. Very well done. Well done, Um Tabila. Not sure if Rachel has come back yet. She's on her way, so we'll just hang fire, Michael, if you don't mind, because I know she's going to ride in the next race and your day is done. Rachel, here we go. Congratulations, well done, all the way to the wire. I must be honest, I believed, notwithstanding that she always runs on strongly, that she's better over 1,000 metres. She's yet to win over 1,200 metres, but you set the record straight today. Yes, uh, thank goodness. Um, I was a little bit worried coming into the straight because we were a bit further back than we planned to be, but she really ran a cracking race, ran on like a demon, and I'm just so grateful again to the support from Mr Roberts. And uh, happy birthday to Miss Roberts, Mr. Roberts's daughter today. So I'm very glad I could bring them a winner on her special day. <laughs> yeah, so this race, as you say, you were a little bit further back than you wanted to be. When you actually hit the line, did you know that you'd got up? No, not at all. I was actually asking um, Mr. Yeni Muzi if we had, uh, if I'd beaten him or not, and we were both not sure. But we saw on the camera coming back, so it was a very good feeling. Um, yeah, we just... I really put a lot of... <laughs> Sorry, I'm blowing quite hard, yeah. I was going to say, it looks like you needed the <laughs> <Yeah>. run. <laughs> I think I did, eh? <laughs> Fluff. Um, but yeah, again, thank you so much to Mr. Roberts, who's really helped me a lot so far, and it's um, really greatly appreciated since everyone has helped me. Um, Gareth Wright as well, who's won on this filly twice, he's gone through the Who Runs with me and helped me a lot to know exactly how to ride her. Um, so a big thank you to him for that. That's number five, if I'm correct. Yes, it is indeed. Desolate road. Any hope that you might ride your sixth winner in about a half an hour or so? Hopefully. I'll try again. <laughs> yeah, um, he should be right there. He's um, well-weighted now with the four kilos off his back. Um, highest merit rates to in the race, so we'll just go for the double, hopefully. Rachel, congratulations. Very well done. And thank you very much to my sponsors, Dasher. Right, let's hear from Mr. Roberts. You only had two runners today. I know he was bitterly disappointed that things didn't pan out well for Golden Grove earlier, but that's racing. Nakia attracted plenty of support, shortened in the market, first win over 1,200. Are you surprised? No, not surprised, uh, Graham. I must be honest with you. I think with the weight uh, of my filly's back, you know, um, it helped her a lot. I did say to, to Rachel to ride a very patient race with her, and, you know, the pace was going to be on, you know, as we know. And, uh, you know, she did it well. I was a bit uh, worried in the straight, you know. Um, I think, you know, she didn't have to switch behind you know, switch in and she came out, she might have won a bit easier, but, you know, you know, she handled the filly very well because, you know, uh, not many jockeys win on her except uh, Gareth Wright, you know, so, it, you know, it was very well, and I'm, I'm, I'm pleased for her, you know, I thought she rode a very nice race, and, you know, obviously it's a very special day today, it's, it's daughter Carolyn's birthday, and Verna owns the filly, so, you know, it's big celebrations tonight.
Just reflecting on Rachel, because you've had a lot to do with her, first of all, getting into the academy, first of all, to get her start race riding, and you must be absolutely delighted that she's already talked up five wins so quickly. Yes, uh, yeah, I'm very proud of her, I must be honest with you, uh, you know, but, you know, you could see from day, you know, for the first time I seen her at the track and when she started to ride work for me, and, you know, like I said, you know, on, on a few times already, you know, she takes everything in and she said, you know, she's a national horsewoman, she's got nice hands and a horse, she sits well, look, uh, the strength and the finish will come later on, but, you know, she's riding a good race, I mean, you know, you know, gravel is not easy, especially in the poly, you know, it's much faster than riding on the turf races, but, you know, she, you know she's adapting and, you know, she's, you know, she's doing it, right you know and uh, no i'm very proud of her i must say michael well done nice start to the season congratulations on carolyn's birthday and please send our best wishes to verna that's very kind of you thanks graham thank you and a big thank you to my staff right there we go seventh race went all the way to the line the full result five four six and nine one to go here at hollywood vets gravel Flags up behind. <laughs>